write to be understood speak to be heard read to grow welcome my dear students to class 3 today we are going to read our next lesson 10 our universe lesson 10 our universe before you read you must have wondered about the universe and the solar system do you know how many planets are there in the solar system read the story to find out about the universe one clear summer night rohan and his father were out taking a stroll suddenly rohan spotted something whizzing down from the sky he shouted loudly look daddy a shooting star rohan tugged at his father's sleeve and said isn't the sky looking nice and bright with so many shining stars our teacher tells us that they are a part of the universe what is the universe his father replied the universe is a huge wide open space it came into being when there was a big explosion called the big bang many million years ago that sounds exciting said rohan please tell me more come let's sit for a while and gaze into the sky as i tell you some fascinating facts about our universe said rohan's father well these twinkling stars are all part of a galaxy the universe has many galaxies and each galaxy is made up of over millions of stars dust and gas wow exclaimed rohan the universe is really big then right daddy yes explained rohan's father and we are the part of one of the many galaxies in the universe our galaxy is called the milky way there are over 100 billion stars in the milky way galaxy and the sun is just one of these stars oh tell me more said rohan okay tonight i shall tell you about a small part of the milky way the sun's family it is called the solar system planets and their moons asteroids meteoroids and comets all form a part of the solar system i shall explain each one of them so that you understand the sun's family better asteroids and meteoroids can be called space rocks some asteroids are known to be as big as a mountain while a meteoroid can be as small as a grain of sand comets are bodies of dust and ice they travel around the solar system in regular orbits a comet is characterized by a long luminous tail but this is visible only when the comet's orbit passes close to the earth mercury venus earth mars eight planets go around the sun of which the first four planets are mercury venus earth and mars mars is also called the red planet 
and can sometimes be spotted with the naked eye on a clear night these four planets are known as the rocky planets the next four planets jupiter saturn uranus and neptune are made of gas hence called giants you cannot stand on them as it would be similar to trying to stand on a cloud saturn has some beautiful rings around it but did you know that these rings are made of small particles of rock dust and ice wow this is very interesting said rohan the earth has one moon and is the only planet inhabited with living things many stars in the sky are like our sun with their own planets and moons rohan's father further explained how fascinating daddy do you think that there could be another earth somewhere in the universe asked rohan i don't know maybe you could discover that when you grow up smiled rohan's father so children i hope you enjoyed reading the lesson our universe in our reader book lesson 10 i hope again that you all will read this lesson at least two times the more that you read the more things you will know the more that you learn the more places you will go so enjoy thank you stay safe stay happy